Kyocera SGS is a manufacturer of solid carbide round cutting tools, end mills, drills, reamers, countersinks. We started the rebuilding process with United Grinding, sending our machines to them and they would rebuild our machines with FANUC controls and a FANUC robot loader. Here at United Grinding North America, what we do is we bring our brands in from Europe. Some drop ship directly to the customers, others come to this facility where we add US-based components, tooling, fixturing, mist collectors, coolant systems, things of that nature. We will run the machines off here. We also offer to rebuild our machine brands here at this facility as well as in Europe, specifically the Walter machines. Our customers have bought a new Walter machine from us possibly since about 2013 and have 20-year-old machines with the Andron control. They see the advantage of the FANUC because it's faster. They have the newest Walter software on there, which they can't run on the older Andron controls. So if they want to get harmony throughout their shop, these are the guys that really come looking to see if we can upgrade their machine to the latest. We have one customer, Kyocera SGS. We offered them to rebuild their machine with a new FANUC control, the new FANUC robot on there, and they've come back to us to rebuild several more machines since then. This was a way to keep cost under control and still upgrade our machines to new processing speeds. Here at Kyocera SGS, we make rotary cutting tools out of carbide for the aeronautics and automotive industries. Our tolerances for most of our high precision products are within five ten thousandths of an inch, so that's like a human hair split ten times. To hold those tolerances, you need a machine that is really tight, that can swing a corner and continue to hold that corner all the way around the edge of the tool. The original machine that we sent out was manufactured in 2001, and we sent it out in 2020, and we got a new machine back a few months later, it's really like a brand new machine. It's able to hold the tolerances that we need and the required finishes that we need for our product here. When we rebuild the machine, we bring it in, we strip it right down to the casting. The only thing the customer gets back that's original is that 20-year-old casting. Then we put all new mechanical components on it, a completely new electrical cabinet, and the new FANUC 30 ID control. Since we've received the machines back, technology has improved. We have better calculation times, especially on multi-flute, long flute length tools. It has been a big improvement. We have machines out in the field, been out there 20 years. They were built, some with cylindrical loaders. Parts for that loader are either not available or are in short supply. We can't really repair them anymore in the field. We now can offer the LR8 robot from FANUC to marry with our FANUC 30 IB controls. By doing this, it's a seamless integration. It's just like the new machines coming from the factory in Germany, and the customers know how to use it. The FANUC robots replace more of a mechanical loading system, and it is much more dependable. Run out in the chuck is a big part of what we need to control for accuracy of the part. The robot loader allows us to do this more accurately and more consistently than the mechanical loading operations. The United Grinding rebuild process has been very successful from our point of view. Machines have come back and gone back into operation within 12 hours from receiving the machine to being back into production. The FANUC controls we have found are very dependable along with the robot. Our in-house maintenance, they're very well versed in FANUC controls. It is our advantage to use FANUCs. Everyone was panicked about FANUC controls on the Walter machines moving from Andron until they got them and realized they're never down. It's a huge advantage.